Come on, boys. Here we go. Come on. Morning, everybody. Grandpa Adler Farms. It is a wonderful morning out here today. It is calm. The sky is beautiful. Look at that. Hooey. Somewhere right over there, the sun is arising. And I'm thinking that we'll go down here, take care of Miss Wilma first. And then we might just run over there to the hill and see if we can catch that sun coming up. See her right down, right down through the lane right there. It's looking good. good morning, young lady. Here, come here. Let's get your pet in before we eat. Let's do it. Because once you eat, that's it. Shake it. Shake it like your mama did. Yeah. Shake it like your mama taught you. Is that how, you, is that, how that goes? Is that what pigs do? Let's get it in here. Oh, that feel good? Get you good scratching? Oh, the belly. How about the belly? You want the belly rub? Let's go. For some of you that are new here and you ask questions about Wilma, uh, Wilma does not belong to us. Actually, Wilma belongs to Mr. G. And this is where she is staying on his property. Hold on a minute. Hold on a minute. What is this? Is that somebody piled that there? That's or she made it. Now look at that. It's a big old wallow that she lays in right there. A wallow of grass. Did you do that, Wilma, or did somebody make that for you, girl? That is, I hadn't seen that before. You all can see the depth on that. Look at that. How that's mounted around there. I didn't do that. Can she do that on her own? That is weird. I don't know. Pretty cool, but it looks like she, I didn't know she... Do pigs do that on their own? I don't know. Huh. Anyway, Wilma belongs to Mr. G. So we feed her and they feed her and, and uh, you know, it'll be Mr. G's decision what to do with Wilma. Uh, I think at this point, everybody pretty much knows that uh, Wilma is going to be uh, uh, providing food for uh, Mr. G's family. And they're a great family, and we are taking care of Wilma, and she is one happy little pig, and that's how we do, one day at a time. We just loving on her, don't we? There you go. Oh, that's a bunch of food. I came out here last night to feed her, as I do every afternoon, and I came down the corner. She didn't run up to me, and I thought, what's wrong? Well, and she was hanging out here around her tree and I come around the corner because usually she's hungry, it's, it's go time. But I came up here and I saw the biggest pile of vegetables and leftovers. Uh, she had had quite a feeding and Mr. G, they feed her also milk and all kinds of stuff. She was not hungry. She, he was, she was barely moving. So I got to spend a lot of time with her when she wasn't, you know, uh, just wanting to eat, which is kind of fun. So, but they take really good care of her too. That's life, that's homesteading. And I would rather do this than to ignore them completely. That's the reality of it, folks. Let's give her a little bit of water, or a lot of water, as much water she needs. Wallow pretty much stays full now. It's not dry and hot. Hey, you want your peanut butter, girl? Yeah, if we gotta give her peanut butter. So we're gonna slap a little peanut butter. We put it on this uh, nipple over here on the water jug. And pretty soon, when she gets done eating her food, she'll come over here and lick that off. All right. Okay, we'll see you after a while. I'll see you this afternoon, okay? You'll probably get leftovers from dinner this afternoon for Mr. G, won't you? Oh, you're looking good. Isn't that beautiful? Okay, now, I'm sure by now the Beachy Boys and Fred are wondering what in the world 
happened to Grandpa. So let's uh, let's go take care of them. I'm back, fellas. I've been waiting on Grandpa. All right, hey Fred, come here, buddy. Hi, Fred. Good morning. Hi, buddy. Yeah. Hi. Honey. Hi. Oh, you think like I had food in my hand? Now you don't have nothing to do with me. Well, let's go. Come on, you ready to go? Come on, we'll go. Let's go eat. Come on. Here we go. A little trot thing going on. I wonder if I ran, if they'd run. You running? Come on. Let's get our jog in. Here we go. Come on, boys. Here we go. Come on. Who is that keeping up? That's 42. All right. Let's go. Come on, come on, come on, stay with me. Let's get that heart pumping. You get, oh, come on, let's go, let's finish it. Come on, finish strong. Here we go. Oh, they're done, they're done. Oh, you guys got to get in better shape. Come on. They're gathering, gathering around the table. And we'll get a little extra, throw a little in the bucket for the boys. Hang on, back up, back up, back up. I see you, I know what's coming. Hang on, here we go, here we go. Little bit here. Sprinkle that in, keep you busy. Come on, Fred. Come here, Bubba. Come here, Fred. Fred, come here. Come on. Come here, Fred. Come here. Right here. Come here. Put yours here. Yeah, that way Grandpa can get between you and the boys. How are you doing this morning, buddy? Ah, oh, man. Had a boy. Yeah. Had a boy, Fred. Yeah, I'm not gonna. There'll be no, I, I know I talked about brushing, but there ain't going to be any brushing maybe on next, next summer. You got to put that winter coat on. I don't know if brushing will pull, the, pull his hair out or not. But right now, trust me, this is enough for me right here. You know, I can't wait till he comes up without us having to have food right there on him. But for now, we're good. Aren't we, buddy? Yeah. He good boy. They're going to come over here after a while, but I wouldn't like get to finish. All right, you're a good boy. Good boy. It ain't that we don't love them beefy boys, do we? It's just that they don't understand. They need to share. They get plenty to eat. We've taken good care of them. Yeah. This little boy's got to have his own here. Don't you, don't you buddy? Don't you, buddy? We'll find you a, a companion here very soon, okay? Maybe two or three. How's that? All righty. I'm gonna head down here in just a couple minutes and we'll go feed the others. You're all right, 44, let him. They uh, they actually, you know, we have opportunity to watch them all day. And they'll come out here 30 minutes from now, they'll be all laying out there within five feet of one another. And they're just com completely fine. It's just a competitive thing over the food, that's all it is. They don't, uh, they don't run him around or hurt him at all. Animals doing what animals do, natural. Now, I talk like I'm an expert. I'm not. Because like I said, this is the first time my grandpa's ever been around critters like that. You guys be good. I'll see you after a while. Yeah, they'll get along fine. Yeah. Let's go feed the other half. Now, now one of y'all, I'm not gonna name names, but you know who you are. You sent me an egg apron. Here, I'll hold it up here against my jacket. You see, see that? So like one, two, three. One, two, three, got, I think you put 15 eggs, put 15 eggs in here. So it's a tie on. I'm going to try this out this morning. I hear you smoke. This is the apron. Remember I said the second person that makes fun of me. Well, you'll be the first of many, I'm sure. But uh, this may come in pretty darn handy. I may kind of like that. We'll try it out and see. Eggs will go right in there in those little slots, and hopefully nobody's going to 
smash in him. So we'll, uh, I appreciate that. We're gonna give it a shot here. It's the first apron I've ever had on, I think. As far as I remember. Come and smoke, come and guys. And you meet me down here, but they were not at the gate yet. We still gotta get to the gate, huh? I got something for you. Yeah, here, there you go. You want that? Eat that? That a girl, okay. Hey, Batman, what you doing, Slick? What are you doing? I know you're not gonna let me pet you like that. Nah, not ready. Yep, gotta get in here. Good morning. Good morning. Oh, are you happy this morning? Was you feeling good? Kisses. Kisses, Grandpa. Kisses, thank you. Oh, already running. All right. Oh, nice, cool morning. It's a good time to run, ain't it, girlfriend? Yeah, it is. Oh, let's get down here. Let's go say hi to everybody. Come on. You don't need to hey. Hello, ladies. All right. We got something new to show you in the big chicken pen here in a minute. Good morning. Little chicken, big rooster. Turkey, turkey. Oh, oh I know it. I know you're all going. Whoa. Uh oh. Watch out. No, oh, no. Where are we going? Hang on, just do it. Hold up. We got to get set up. We play a different game. Yeah. We play something different. Hold on. Hold on. Watch the camera. Come on. Gotcha. Ooh, yeah. All right. Well, we got that in. That's always fun. Okay. All right. Oh, this big girl. Okay. Okay, 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 okay. Okay. All right. All right, here we go. Come on, everybody. Let's eat. Come on, here we go. Come on. Right here. here, Batman. Right here, Batman. Spread out. Spread out. Just letting everybody spread out. Spread out. Spread out. Hold on, let Grandpa get by. Hold on. It's okay. Oh, good. Good. Oh, hang on. Okay. All right. Okay. Ooh, that was fun. I'll have to get you. You know, I know, I know you want an egg, but we have to wait just a minute. I'm gonna get the boys, the boy and the girl. Zuh. Now, Grandpa, don't forget to close the gate. If you don't close the gate, what happens? I know. Hang on. Close it. Yep, stay. All right. What do we got going on? Let's see. You've been playing Frisbee with your water. Frisbee with your food bowl. Let me get food first before I come in there. Those girls, girls. Girls, girls, girls. So I did a little research on piggy pigs. Not, not an expert, but I Googled it. Oh, hang on. Here, Lola. Here, hang. Lola. There we go. Here we go. Here we go. Okay, here we go. Let's not touch the fence. Hey, princess. Oh, no, hey. Come over here, honey. You're okay. It's okay. Stay right here. Yep, you got food right there. And my research showed I was going to give Han and Lola and Princess Leia, we got a bunch of hay, and I was going to bring some hay over. Well, they're not really into hay. They will eat it if they have to. Believe it or not, they don't eat a lot of grass. They eat grass to get to the dirt, to get to the grubs and the roots. So that's why you do have to grain feed pigs because they cannot make it on grass alone. It's not it's not good for them to only eat grass. I forgot about Han. Sorry, Han. So, uh, you know, I don't have to worry too much about giving them hay. I do give Han some grass and the ladies will eat grass, but they uh, their main, main source will be grubs and roots and, and the grain we feed them. Buddy, let me turn it over. Man. Here, let me turn it over. Okay. 
remember a couple of weeks ago I was bragging about my egg stash in Han's house, but I haven't found any. I haven't found any in there in probably a week and a half or so. But we're going to check her one more time. I'm going to. I'll send you all in there. You can tell me if there's any eggs in there. See any? Any eggs? I ain't crawling in there. I uh, I couldn't see any. That's all right. That's a good thing. That's all right. Those eggs, are, those chickens are laying plenty of eggs right now, and I, I guess when it gets colder, they'll quit laying. I don't know. That's what somebody said, but we'll see. I'll look it up. I'll Google it. I'll Mac Google it. Mac Google that. That's what we'll do. This right here is our automatic uh, pig water for Princess Leia and uh, Lola. That's from Tartar also. It's a good, uh, I really like it. Now we get our water going. And I got my water girl right here. She always helps me. Yeah, she gets a bird's eye view on the water buckets. And the petting doesn't, petting doesn't hurt, does it, huh? No, no, no pretty girl. More Magneto. Hello, sassy. Just a note. <laughs> Magneto and his girls are the only ones that can free roam and free range in Smokey's area. And they have this agreement. They leave each other alone. And he is right here. And I guarantee you, Smokey's been up here a dozen times. And he, there's just, there's just some of this, there's this mutual respect that they have. And, they, he, and Smokey also knows that he is going to protect his ladies. Now, I don't know where the other one at. She may be up in the coop. We'll find out here. So I think that's pretty interesting. So let's get in there now. Let's go feed the feed the ladybirds. Ladies and gentlemen, now for the entertainment part of our program, we're going to play Can the Chickens Find the Worms? You guys ready? Let's gather around. Gather around. Here we go. Let's play. Dun, da, dun, 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 da, dun. Dun, da, dun, 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 dun. All right, now you can't, now you're a little too close to the, you're cheating. You're cheating, you can't stand in the water. You're cheating. You're cheating. We have rules to this game. You gotta go back up. Where's Little Red? Little Red, what are you doing down here? All right, you're out. You don't come around. First come, first serve. Come on, man. You gotta be something. Come on. Come on. Nothing? Now, some of you said, in fact, somebody sent us some, uh, worms or the larvae in a, in a package. Uh, I have not got them yet. They arrived yesterday. I'll probably try to get them uh, maybe today or tomorrow. Anything in there? No. So that way when I come down, I'll, I'll uh, have something to throw, throw down. So I know. What's the matter? Where's everything at? Where is everything? Watch out. Watch out. Nothing there. Oh. Oh, look. What's that? What looky there? Well, hello. Nothing there. Oh, oh, look. What's that? What looky there? Well, hello. <laughs> the chicken got under the water dish and fell on top of her. Oh, my goodness. All right. Okay. Sometimes under the buckets, there might be a little something, something. And I know y'all waiting on some food here. Hang on. Anything under there? No. Here. Whoops. Watch out. Anything under there? No. All right. Thanks for playing. There will be a little consolation prize for everybody. Hello. Come on. Hey, let's go. Let's go show them what's new. Here at uh, Adler Farms, we repurpose everything. That much we've learned. So we got a food dish here. And now, as you know, we got Smokey a new dish. And Chad actually came up with this idea. We're going to use her old feeder for chicken feed. See? So now we put chicken feed in there. And I mounted it to this pallet. So it'll stay there. So now we got two places. Because when I put it on the ground, putting it on the ground, they don't really, look at there, they go right to it. So now they can have two places to eat from. Awesome. All right, let's get some eggs. I'm gonna put one here. Look at that. One in the apron. Uh-oh, knock the bucket down. Two in the apron. 
There's two. Let's see how many are in here. Hopefully there's several. What? None. Two eggs? Come on. I got a last night. Actually, uh, actually last night I got probably five out of there. They had a bunch. I don't know if they'll be. Oh, look. I got one here. Sweet. All right, now I'm going to put this in my apron. Oh, lay in sage, Grandpa. Don't forget. Don't forget. But look. Look, Ma. No hands. Don't have to carry them like that. I do have an egg. Now, I do have an egg basket. Uh, sometimes I forget it. But hopefully, maybe, we're going to see how this goes. If I don't put anything up against there and crush them. All right, ladies. You ready for a little scratchy scratch? Here we go. Come on. I know what you want. I know what you want. Here we go. Here. I'm going to spread this out. Go. Heard the running of the bulls. This is the run of the chickens. Get up. <laughs> well, why do you hang around the bucket for? You know? Throw some down here. All right, one more and you're done. All right, you guys find it. You're good. You're good. Come here, look at there, Smoke. What do you think of this? Look at that. See, now, look at there, Smoke. Just take it out. Ta-da. Here we go. It's all here. Your grandpa put it in here. I'll put it right there. There we go. Here's a little scratch right here. That's your each spot. There you go. There you go. All right. Some water for the big boy. Watch out, Smoke. Pour that water out of him. Oh, there's a worm right there. That's a worm. Here, you want that worm? I'll feed him the worm. All right. Fed and water in here now. Everybody's happy in here. Are we good to go? Do some scratch. There we go. Uh, no big food. You got big food. You got plenty of big food. Your water, your water's fairly clean, but I'm here. Fresh water. Why not? Let's do it. You all are getting big. You're getting big. There's Magneto. Look. What's the matter, Red? You don't like Magneto in there? Huh? Come here. Huh? No. Don't want anything to do. All right, it's okay. Don't flip out. Don't act like chickens. Don't be chickens, turkeys. I'm backing out. It's all yours. Magneto, where's your other lady? Huh? You guys want some scratch? Hey, hey, hey. Hey, Batman. Hi, buddy. Hi, buddy. Oops, hang on. Are we buddies now, finally. See, we're family buddies, Grandpa. Yeah, we are. Ellen and Fox. Oh, yeah, not to be a little Mr. Jealous. Your, your brothers are getting rowdy. Mm -hmm. I think they're silly. They're playing. King of the Hill. Button heads. Literally butting heads. Oh, they're going to lock the... Oh, you're tearing up the furniture. Oh, there we go. That's how we do it. You're tearing the furniture up. Those stinkers. Goodness. All right, let's uh, get you some. Let me get this hay fixed up. You knocked it over. Okay. Yeah, P dub, you guys. All right. Okay. Now, lesson number two today after the um, hay for the pigs. You know, I've got this down low the hay for the goats, right? Almost not quite on the ground. I had it up here. They still reach from here to there, which I know I could move this, but this allows them to get up there fairly easy. And I also did a little homework, which I've done before, but I wanted to make sure no matter what you do, pigs are pigs. <laughs> you guys aren't pigs. No matter what you do, goats are going to waste food, whether you pull it out the top, the bottom. And once it goes on the ground, boys, dad, grandpa's trying to have a conversation do you mind apparently you don't huh P dead so no matter what they're going to waste it it's going to the ground goats don't like to eat off the ground so if the hay hits the ground and if they wee wee on it or do anything hi buddy 
they're they're not going to eat it so best advice is you can do all that you want make the fanciest bins whatever they're going to pull it out falls on the ground goes to waste so uh then the next best thing you turn it into compost you put it in the chicken pen which i do and you just you just live with it and that's how it is so i'm going to leave it down there uh and uh as long as they'll eat some of it are we happy with that we're happy with that i like the goats they're some of my they're some of my favorites say grandpa that that has to be the favorite right there the smoky girl yeah then the goats maybe the cows maybe grandpa doesn't have favorites maybe we just love everybody hmm yeah we just love everybody Shh, smoky don't tell him you're my favorite okay thank you all for coming along help me feed the animals this morning it was a good morning. Let's uh, walk back down our path here. Oh, it's always a pretty little walk. Sunshine coming through the trees. Very nice. We're, hey, we got one more shot here out on the porch at least. Oh yeah, at least. You know, here we are. I think a couple more days it's gonna be cold again, but this is not too bad. You know, on the, on the uh, last video, you know, Chad and I both had to kind of keep him from mm -hmm. uh, Beefy Boy's way, but uh, Chad did a great job uh, setting up that little fence down there. Mm -hmm. Great, I used it today, and it was fantastic. And he knows it too, man. He just looks at him, and he, he, you know, he takes his nose and goes like that, you know. And I said, dude, you keep messing with him. They're been talking to him. But I do worry about you huh? trying to stop a, you know, nine hundred pound I just, deer. I just did the ole. It's, it's, it was running of the bulls in uh, southwest Missouri instead of over wherever they do that. Chad, uh, you know, he let the uh, little chickens out. Oh, he did? Yeah, and I rearranged her little chicken thing. He put uh, the cool rooster back into the big chicken pen, and he did. He's, he's got it made, man. He's, he's got like now. 50 chicks in there. <laughs> you know what I mean? He's walking around, chest sticking How out. How chicks feel about it? Yeah, man, he's, he's just, yeah. Hey, I got big news. Hey, is that Fred? I have big news. I know. I just was looking right straight ahead and I can't tell if that's Fred looking at us. That's Mac Fred. That's what I thought. Mac Fred. Hey, Fred. Mac Fred. You got to say it. Mac Fred. I don't do that. I, huh? I don't do Scottish. Yeah. He's looking I, at you. Like but not he now. expects you to come over and pet him. Mac Fred. This is Mac Grandpa. <laughs> I'm Mac Grandma up here. <laughs> Aye. I, I wore my apron. Did you see? I wore the apron. In the video. Yeah. Yeah, mm -hmm. I got the apron thing going on. Um, I thought I was styling. I did too. I really thought you were doing well until you got down to the last egg and you told Smokey that she couldn't have it and then you started feeling guilty and gave it to her anyway. So I'm not sure why you need a basket or an apron. I, I know. I'm not coming home with any You're eggs. You're not coming home with any eggs. <laughs> oh, well, it's those eyes. You know, she looks at those big old eyes. and it never works when I do that. Oh, you don't... <laughs> Would you please feed my birds? I can't look at you. <laughs> I can't look. Don't. I can't take that look. I'll just say yes. Uh, big any news? big news? Big news. Worked on the uh, greenhouse today. Really? Yes. I got ten more parts put on there. <laughs> well, I'm telling you. I listen. I'm telling you right now. That'll be done this time next year. That greenhouse is going to be done. And by the way, everybody's really big supporting KNS Get Out, Colin Shannon. Really appreciate I know, it. That's awesome. Yeah, it is awesome. They're doing uh, yep. doing really well. Thanks to everybody out there. Oh, another big announcement. Boy, I tell you, I'm just full of it today. I mean, I'm just today? I'm just full of big announcements today. Yes, let's hear it. You know, I was talking about subscribers, and I didn't care for that, and you know how impersonal it was, and. And then I, I, I thought, you know, it's kind of a, you know, they know a lot about us. We know a lot about them, like, like family, you know, that, that you don't see, but you really, but you know real well. I was thinking about bringing it in a little bit. Adler Farms family. Adler Farms family. So I, I'd rather say Adler Farm family. Sorry. Thank you to everyone who belongs to the Adler Farms family. <laughs> we thank everybody we who do. watches we do we truly really truly do until next time until next time see you bye bye